Lumarca is Latin for a light box. Uh, luma is light, arca is box. I always wanted to make something 3D. I always wanted to make something that was actually a 3D thing that you could see in the real world, not some sort of mediated 3D that you were seeing through uh, through a screen. I was sort of playing with the idea of like, what does it mean to bring technology into real three-dimensional space? Like the space that's in Counter-Strike and in, in like any first-person shooter and bring it to the theatrical stage or bring it to some sort of like space that is the space around our bodies. There's always two moments of, of sort of awe when people see the project for the first time in real life. It's like, wow, what is this thing that is occupying the real world that's moving in real three dimensions? Uh, and then they sort of like get into, wait, how is this happening? And then we explain to them that it's just yarn and projection and it's sort of like a second blowing of their minds. Materials wise, uh, the string, it was just four pounds of white cotton yarn. So it was like 50 bucks. The projector we're borrowing from iBeam, um, and just like a lot of time, the tape, the gaffer's tape is, I mean, gaffer's tape isn't cheap, so the tape on the ground is probably, you know, uh, 20 bucks. So all in all, I mean, like compared to a lot of other volumetric displays, this thing's dirt cheap, right? No spinning plates, no like crazy robotics, um, no LEDs. Some people, the fir they first see it and then they like, they like feel um, cheated or something. <laughs> like they like immediately in disbelief, the f as as a first response, and then they like need to coax themselves into acknowledging that this thing actually exists in front of them. Thank you.